Princess Catherine and her family have found sanctuary at their home in Amner Hall, where she, Prince William, and their children will close off from the world and move on as she goes through cancer. Treatment. The Wales family today were pictured boarding a helicopter on their way to their country home, Amner Hall in Norfolk, where they are expected to spend their Easter break together. People close to the Prince of Wales has said that the royal couple are now in a position of facing a situation where George, Charlotte, and Louis's mother's health is now in the public sphere. The trio is still processing the news that their mother has been treated for early stages of cancer. Meanwhile, William has undoubtedly drawn from his experiences of his mother Diana's death when he was just 15 and put him into protection mode he's in now. The children, with almost one month off, aren't due back into the classroom until April 17th. While many of the princess would have resumed her royal duties by Easter when she would make her grand reappearance, after the latest bombshell, the royal is not expected to join the rest of the firm for the traditional Easter service in Windsor and instead focuses their energies supporting each other. The form of cancer has not been disclosed, but the future queen began a course of preventative chemotherapy late in February. She's said to have a positive mindset for her recovery and is in good spirits, describing herself as well and getting stronger every day. No doubt as the family will spend the next few weeks away from the public eye, particularly after Catherine has asked for privacy while she focuses on her recovery. A royal aide said that William just wants to protect his wife and children during this difficult time. As they get away from the world at their home at Amner Hall, a Georgian country house, which is part of the Sandringham estate in the village of Amner, Norfolk, where they will focus on their family and not the royal institution or monarchy as a whole. The royal aide said they are not a corporation like Apple, but just two human beings. They added that Catherine shared the news of her cancer diagnosis when she, William, and their children felt comfortable to do so. In her statement yesterday, she said that she and Prince William explained the situation to their children, George, Charlotte, and Louis, after the huge shock of her diagnosis. A Kensington Palace spokesperson said the prince and princess are both enormously touched by the kind messages from people here in the UK, across the Commonwealth, and around the world in response to her Royal Highness's message. They are extremely moved by the public's warmth and support and are grateful for the understanding of their request for privacy at this time. The King, who aims to lead the family in a show of unity on Easter Sunday, has spoken of his pride in his beloved daughter-in-law in her courage for speaking out. Royal sources said Charles, who is also fighting the disease after being diagnosed in February, is hoping to make the journey to St. George's Chapel in Windsor next weekend to reassure the public amid incredibly testing times for the royals. With the head of state and the future queen both receiving treatment for the royal family faces an uncertain period, but the monarchy is expected to rally round to support those at the heart of the institution. A royal source said the king has been keeping in touch with the Princess of Wales from the moment she was admitted to the hospital in January and throughout her current cancer treatment. He is utterly determined to put on a show of unity for his family and reassure the public and wider world that the monarchy is stable despite the current tumultuous period.